of the Western Fells, which consist of five Wainwrights, and these are the most isolated ones in the west of them all. We're going along this road to start with. We've come off to the right and joined this path, so just going to start the climb up. The first one we're going to is called Grike. We're still walking along this path up here, but I have had to put my waterproof trousers and rain cover on. Even though the sun looks like it's coming out, it's still a bit rainy and a bit windy. We're now headed towards this gate here. We're heading through this pretty path now. Off to the left now. <laughs> oh my gosh, that was crazy. It was massive, it literally flew straight over us, that was mad. That one up there could be Lank Rig, our last Wainwright of the day. Crossing this style just here, that view is so pretty. Grike, 488 metres tall. Just following this path along here. We're beginning the descend down, back, and then we'll come back up to the second wane right of the day. We've come across this massive boggy bit. I mean it's not that big but it's very boggy and we're coming over this stile up to Cragfell. That could be the top up there. I'm not 100% sure though. Unfortunately the wind and this was so loud so this is Cragfell 523 meters. It's so windy up here. <laughs> that water down there is Ennerdale. We're just stopping to have a cup of tea and a biscuit. A bit of tiny very hard kendall mint cake and a cup of tea. We're coming off the summit and heading the wall over here. The sunshine, oh my gosh. That view is just amazing. You can see the bits of sun in the valley out down there. So we've crossed this pretty good style and we're going to start coming up on this path and a lot of heather. We're passing by this sort of tree graveyard with a lot of heather in it and following this fence up and I reckon we'll get to this brick fence soon. summit up here of Corfell. We're not entirely sure but there's a few people up there so we could have lunch or we could come back to where we were at a second ago and have lunch there. We're thinking that this cairn over here is the summit and this is just past the shelter I showed you a second ago.
heading back to the shelter for lunch. For lunch we have the usual cheese sandwich and carrot. And it, the sun is definitely trying to come out and it's trying to warm up. So yeah. the path that led us back over to Cragfell and now we're going to take a left at the bottom and go over to the last wing right called Lang Creek. Back up the ascent and then we'll cut left at some point. It's so windy, oh my gosh. You can see the power station in the distance We've stopped for a cup of tea behind a wall. up this path. You can see the path that will be coming back down and around over the lip to the car. We're beginning to start the ascend up to Lankrig. This is very steep this bit. this weird sticky uppy grass as a landmark to show us that we were nearly at the top on the way up. That's the path down here that we'll be taking. You can see the path that we went down and we're following this one here. We're headed over that bit there come all the way down this bit of the valley. I think we're approaching the car now where we've come such a long way. I mean, we've come from that path along there. A long way. We can see the road just there. So that means we're super close. That right there is our car. This car feels like heaven.